Okay, so yung next lesson is dividing decimals by decimals. So, nagdi-divide tayo ng decimal sa decimal. So, to divide a decimal by another decimal, change the divisor to a whole number. Okay, by moving the decimal point to the rightmost place. Okay, so ipapakita ko mamaya sa example natin yan. Move the decimal point in the dividend to as many places as the decimal point in the divisor is moved. Okay, divide like whole number. So, pag na-move na, di-divide na daw as a whole number. Okay, so makikita natin sa example. Okay, so na yun. Dividing decimals by a decimal. Okay, so divide 23.8 divided by 0.7. So decimal sa decimal, sabi dun sa rule, i-move daw yung divisor para maging whole number. So i-move sa right para maging whole number 1. So whole number na siya 7. Kung ilaw yung move mo dito, ganun din yung move mo sa dividend sa loob. Kung isa lang, isa lang din. Okay? Kung dalawa yung move mo para maging whole number, dalawa yung move mo sa loob. So, kung isa lang, isa lang din. Then, i-rewrite natin para hindi natin, hindi tayo malito. So, that is 2, 3, 8. Pag nag-move ka, ayun na, then ito, 7 na yan. Okay? So, nawala na. Para ka lang nag-divide ng whole number. Okay? So, 23 divided by 7, that is uh, 3. 3 times 7 is 21. Okay? Then, minus... 3 minus 1 is 2. Ito wala na. 0 na yan. So bring down 8. And 28 divided by 7 is 4. 4 times 7 is 28. And minus magiging 0 na yan. So the, our answer is 34. Okay. So ganun lang yung rule. Dividing decimal by decimal Okay, i-move natin yung divisor. Kung ilan para maging whole number. Kung ilan yung move mo dito para maging whole number, ganun din i-move mo sa dividend. 1. Okay, then rewrite. Then divide. Intindihan ba natin? So, tumutok lang dito sa mag-tutor. Learn to love math. Till next time.